Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Jessica and today I have a special video for you. I don't know if you can tell what I'm drawing, but it is dun 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 a shark. So if you don't know, it is Shark Week here in the US. On the Discovery Channel in the evening, they have a couple episodes that are always new and it's just educating um, the public about sharks and everything related to sharks. So if you love Shark Week, feel free to comment below and let me know. Um, I love watching it. It's pretty awesome, the footage they get. Pretty crazy, the things they do too. But, so I had a totally different video I was ready to upload this week and I started watching Shark Week and I was like, oh my gosh, I want to paint a shark. So this is just a quick shark sketch. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about it. I started with the fish first. I only sketched out the shark. I had no other plans. Um, I really winged it. I just, you know, I was editing the video I was gonna post and I just said, you know what? I'm just gonna feel like filming this shark video. So these fish I painted first. Um, I painted them first and then did the background so that way they were kind of blurred out and seem more in the distance. And I'm just starting with the lightest color for the background. And I wet the whole paper with just plain water and then I brush the color on and I'm trying to get a darker color near the bottom so that it shows kind of like the depth of the ocean and the shark kind of coming out um, almost like unexpectedly, kind of like how it does in the show sometimes, which I love and it's so creepy and cool. Um, the part that I struggled with <laughs> in this painting is the uh, top of the ocean, like the top of the water, is that what you would call it, the top, the surface? That's probably it. Um, I wanted to like imitate the ripples in the water and I don't know if I did a good job of that. I did try my best, so let me know what you guys think or if you have um, any tips. But yeah, so that's my ocean surface. Then I start with my shark and it's a great white by the way, for being technical here. Um, so I start with his eye and his mouth because that was pretty dark. Um, the nose, and they have spots, which I didn't know until I really looked at the picture. Probably they're like sensors. Um, and here I'm trying to draw in the, like the scars on the shark, and I dab them with a paper towel to lighten them up. Um, but still so they show up on his body. And right there I did a dry brushing technique and I didn't mean to. I didn't have enough water on my brush but I was like, oh I, I kind of like the way that turned out. It makes it give it more texture. So then I started to do that all over the shark. And some of you might say, oh, the white shark, the great white has a white underneath. And yes, it does. But it was, um, the underneath of his belly was reflecting the ocean. So that's why I painted it blue. I did leave some white areas though for reflection and highlights. Isn't this creepy music too? Like I was looking through the YouTube library and I was like, uh, this is perfect. This is almost like a Jaws theme. Here I'm just going in and darkening up some of the fish to make them seem more in the foreground and give it more depth. And then I looked at it and I realized that 
the ocean didn't seem dark enough near the bottom, so I want to darken that up as well. And to finish off the painting, I just take some uh, what I would consider Payne's Gray and I just dry brush that over to give him just a little more contrast. And he's just about finished, so let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button to support my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video.